In this exercise, we'll subtract and simplify 17 24ths minus 1 15th. Before we can subtract, we must have a common denominator. The denominators in these fractions are 24 and 15, so we need to find the least common multiple of 24 and 15 in order to rewrite the fractions with a common denominator. Looking at the largest denominator, 24, 24 is not a multiple of 15, so we will need to use another kind of procedure to find the least common multiple of the two numbers. We will, in this case, use prime factorizations. So I will find the prime factorization of 24, which is 2 times 2 times 2 times 3. The prime factorization of 15 is 3 times 5. So the least common multiple of 24 and 15 is the product of each of the prime numbers that appears in these factorizations the greatest number of times that it appears in any one factorization. So we'll start with 2. We have three factors of 2 in 24, so the least common multiple must contain three factors of 2. The next prime we see is 3. There is one factor of 3 in 24, one factor of 3 in 15. The least common multiple will then need one factor of 3. The other prime number that we see is 5. There is one factor of 5 in 15 and none in 24, so we need one factor of 5. And that is the least common multiple. Multiplying that out, we have that the least common multiple is 120. So now we have to write 17 24 and 1 15 with a denominator of 120. To do that, we need to multiply by 1, and we think 24 times what is 120? Well, an easy way to see that is to look at 24 is 2 times 2 times 2 times 3, and the least common multiple is 2 times 2 times 2 times 3 times 5, so we need a factor of 5. So we multiply 7 24 by 5 fifths. Now we need to write 1 15th with a denominator of 120. Again, looking at the least common multiple, we notice that what's missing from the least common multiple with 15 is three factors of 2, or 8. So we multiply 1 15th by 8 over 8. Carrying out the multiplications, multiplying numerators, multiplying denominators, we get 85 over 120 minus 8 over 120. And now we have a common denominator. So we can subtract numerators, 85 minus 8 over 120. And carrying out the subtraction, we get 77 over 120. We do need to check if we can simplify. I noticed that 77 is 7 times 11, and neither 7 nor 11 is a factor of 120. So this cannot be simplified, and 77 over 120 is the simplified answer to the problem.